Hey my loves, so um, back with another little Sephora haul. Um, on rare occasion I do order from the website, and I say rare occasion because I basically never order from the website because I'm impatient, I want to get my stuff right away. But um, this was one of the instances where it paid to be a beauty insider and there were some perks that I will talk about in a second. And so the only way to redeem those perks was to order online, so that's what I did. Um, so I'm just gonna dig right in. Okay, so I put like all the paper back in here as if to say I haven't opened it. I just cut it open so it wouldn't spend an hour ripping it open. But there's already one of the products in there that's already on my face. So, yeah. I told you I want my products right away. Um, yeah, I'm just going to dig right in and we'll get to it. <laughs> so, what is already on my face is actually not something that I ordered online. That's why it's on my face. Sure, let's say that's why it's on my face. Not because even if it was for my order, I wouldn't have opened it and already put it on my face. Um, anyways, it's the Dior Addict It Lash uh, Mascara in It Pink. So I saw Mallory's video on these guys. She probably posted it a little sooner, but I only think I saw it yesterday. And then I went out and I picked this up today. Um, I'm going to zoom in and show you. I put it on my eyes already. You guys, can you guys see that on my lashes? Can you see that? No, I feel like a librarian. But I hope it's picking up on camera. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous pink mascara that just, yeah, I was walking around the mall because I wanted to try it on before I picked it up. So I put it on at the Sephora store and I loved it. And then I walked to the NARS counter because um, I almost wanted to buy it back up for my hot sand illuminator. illuminator. And then I decided not to. But the girl was like, is that the Dior Mascara you one? I was like, yeah. Yeah, it is. Um, I'm going to see you guys back out. <laughs> but yeah, um, so it made me happy that like other people could see it. It wasn't just me pretending. Um, not pretending. It wasn't only me. This is why I don't film after work. Um, that could see it. So yeah, this is... So I will link Mallory's whole review with all of the mascaras from this line down in the description box because you should go you should go watch Mallory anyways if you haven't already she's amazing she replies to everyone she does really really great reviews and she is gorgeous her tutorials are phenomenal like she transforms into these women it's out of this world um and she's just an amazing human being so yeah I will link that video down below for sure on all these because there's I got the pink one but there's a blue one a purple one and a black one I believe um I will link her video down below to, for that this is the one I got so like you saw it's the pink color and it comes in this kind of tube the top like that and then show you the wand sort of like so but yeah that's the wand on it and that bright hot pink color is the color that you get um, yeah so that's the first thing in my package and like I said this was something I picked up in the store because ironically my package arrived today um, and I was also planning to go to the mall today to get that after Mallory's recommendation. So thank you, Mallory, if on some odd chance you're watching. Thank you so much. I really love it. I'm so, so excited about it. Um, and like I was saying, I wanted to back up my NARS Hot Sand Illuminator. I used it in my glowy makeup tutorial that I'll link down below. But I've been loving that illuminator. And I haven't backed it up yet. Like, I haven't bought a backup. But I feel like I may soon buy a backup because I love it. Um, the other item that I actually did order online, and it was only online, we don't have it in our local stores, is Paracone MD, um, you know who does all the skincare? I guess they're coming up with this, like, no makeup makeup line, so, um, they have a no foundation foundation, which is what I got, and they have, like, a no bronzer bronzer, no blush blush, so it's all supposed to be, like, has, uh, skincare type ingredients in it, and is really lightweight, and all that kind of good stuff. So this is the no, uh, the no Foundation Foundation in, where's the shade, number one, Fair to Light. So the original one, this is not a new product, but the original one only came in one shade, whereas this is a new version that has a Fair to Light and then a Light to Medium, so there are two shades. Um, and I'm just opening this now, so I'm trying to see if there's any pertinent information on the box to give you. So there's no foundation, foundation number one, broad spectrum, FPF, SPF 30. You guys know I'm going to do a review on this guy, so not to worry. So you get one ounce of product. It seems small for one ounce. No, just me. All my other foundation bottles seem like they're a lot bigger for one ounce of product. 
um, broad spectrum and it says application Dr. Pericone recommends applying evenly with your fingertips to face and circular motions. So it does come with a pump which is good. I guess the older one also didn't come with a pump so I'm glad to see that. Um, I will do a whole review on this guy so I'm not going to like open into it and get foundation all over my nice dress pants. But um, that was the item that I got and it was $65 from what I remember so it's a little bit pricier um, in terms of the range of prices of foundation. But yeah. Um, and then what I was telling you about is this sort of set that I told you um, it paid to be, oh, the white is going to wash us out, uh, or it pays to be a VIB member. So every so often they'll release these codes that you can sort of redeem um, online for free stuff. So I remember around the holidays there was a code that was like Diorific, and if you put that in you could get a free Diorific lipstick from Sephora. Um, they have codes for like free bare minerals, foundation, like deluxe sample sizes. I got a deluxe sample size Codely eye cream one time and it's like a decent amount. Like it's almost like the size of like a travel size if you were to buy a travel size. So it definitely pays to sign up. To sign up to be a Beauty Insider is free and you get the um, the benefit of, of obviously you get per points that you can redeem for perks which I redeemed a couple in here that I'll show you. And then um, you can also can also do what you can also get these kinds of benefits um, so this was the fresh whatever I will if I find that code and it's still valid into everything, I'll put it down in the description box um, so I have had the lip treatment from fresh before there which is this guy the sugar advanced therapy lip treatment and I loved it for my dry lips. Um, the one thing was mine just ran out super quickly so I um, that was the one downside because it is expensive but I loved it as a lip therapy so this is not quite the full size if you can tell it's, I don't have a full size to compare it to but I don't know it's like this big it looks like it's almost about half the size of a full size if that makes sense and it's just like a clear it's really great I love this stuff so um for no extra work other than I found a code that I actually got in an email so it wasn't even like I had to dig, get to do any digging. I got this guy and then I got um, the they have the lip polish so like a lip scrub like a sugar lip scrub. It's like a brown sugar lip scrub and um, and then a lip treatment which I'm not actually sure what this is. But we'll see. Oh, it's like a lip. It says lip shine lip treatment. It almost looks like a little lip gloss. This packaging reminds me of, do you guys remember the Temperature Rising collection from MAC from last year? That's what it reminds me of. Okay, so that, and then because I'm a VIB Rouge, I got a free little, the Sugar Rosé lip treatment. So these are the tinted ones. Um, and this is, again, this, that same, like, sort of half size. Let's see if I can watch that yeah so it's not a, like it's just a tiny bit tinted um but that's exciting so sometimes if you're VIB Rouge or VIB um, versus just like Beauty Insider which are just levels attained I guess um, based on how much you spend any given year there are some extra perks to be had so um, yeah and then I will show you I got a couple of samples so I got the Clarins uh, extra firming day cream and then okay this is what drives me mental online you select the the samples that you want and then they tell you that if they're out of stock they'll put something else instead but to this day like I logged in today to check where my package was before it got here yeah I'm that person um, and it told me that the samples that I had were still in stock so I don't know why they sent me these ones but they sent me the fresh life eau de parfum um, Makeup Forever Pressed Powder. I have like four of these already, so I don't know what that is. And this one I did actually ask for, so I got this one, which is the Becca Brown Bronzing Skin Perfector, so I'm excited to try that. Um, so those were the free samples, and then I collected, I haven't gotten any point perks in quite a long time. Ugh. Um, but I found a bunch that I wanted this time. So I got the Eliz Elizabeth and James Nirvana Black perfume so this is a little one 
uh, 7 milliliters, but I've heard only awesome things about this guy, so I'm excited. And I noticed that they just brought out the white um, in the 100 point perk. When I was there to get my um, mascara, they were out of stock, so I'm going to try to hunt down the white one because you're supposed to be able to pair them together and they work well that way. So I'm excited to at least start playing with this one because Jasmine, I think, told me that this one is great. So I'll link Jasmine's channel down below. Um, and then the other little 100 point perk, perk was this Becca Evermatte Poreless Priming Perfector. It's like a, uh, a mattifying base. So I'm excited to try that as well. And then I finally cashed in a 500 point perk. I've never cashed. No, that's a lie. When did I cash? It's been a long time since I cashed in a 500 point perk. But I got this set from Caudalie, which has a cleanser, uh, tr some serum, and a perfecting fluid. So, um, let's break into this bad boy. This is the makeup removing cleansing water. I don't think I've ever had a cleansing water to remove my makeup, so I'm interested to see how that goes. And then this Radiance Serum. It's a complexion correcting serum. And then, what is this? Broad Spectrum SPF 15 Day Perfecting Fluid. It's that one. Um, I will definitely try all these out. I told you I also have like a deluxe sample. Can I get lip gloss everywhere? A deluxe sample of the... Um, of their like of their their face cream why can't I speak today um, so I'm probably going to just sort of test out all these different quality products and then do like a little video just on their products to see what I liked what I didn't like um, and all that kind of good stuff so yeah that's my little haul for the day I think that's all I want to tell you I don't think I have anything else let me know what you guys have been hauling recently um, and yeah, it's springtime, so I've sort of gone through a collect. I like go through my collection of stuff every couple months and clear out things I haven't been using, donate them to good homes, and then sort of re not reprioritize, but take a look at stuff that I have been using and stuff I haven't been using, so I know when I'm making makeup purchases in the future, what are things that I do get used of and stuff that I don't. So like things like I think I showed this one when I did the uh, lipstick better buying lipstick technique video, um, I'll put that below, but I really like bright coral lipsticks, but I never wear them that often, so I try not to buy them anymore that often, but yeah, that's what I sort of do when I go through my bunch of stuff and see what I should be buying and what I'm not using, so I shouldn't buy any more of. Anyways, let's do three points of positivity. So the first is, is good mail makeup days. Um, I love getting fun mail and even more when it's makeup and I get to play with it, so I'm excited to play with all these new goodies. It was fun, I got a, like I only paid for the foundation, okay, and the mascara, but I got a bunch of other goodies that I get to play and test out and research for you guys, so that's always fun. Um, my second point of positivity goes sort of hand in hand with that, which is I get to talk to you guys about all this stuff. Like it's exciting when I get a package, but no one quite gets my excitement, so being able to like sit down and film and I know that it's gonna go to a group of people that also get how exciting this is, that's really so much fun. It like compounds the excitement, if that makes sense. So that's definitely my second point of positivity. And my third point of positivity is this great um, new spray from Sage Wellness. It's called the Namaste Uplifting Mist. I'm gonna spray some around, but it's just like, it's very, cooling and relaxing and see if it tells me the ingredients there's some essential oil so there's like lavender and citrus and orange and indian neroli and geranium rose and of course there's patchouli <laughs> i had to put that out there uh patchouli is my amazing friend Rada's channel name i will link her channel down below but no wonder it calms me down i actually hadn't even noticed that it had patchouli in it until i was reading it but any time I spray it, I'm just like, just an immense sense of calm. I like sort of spray it around my room before I want to go to bed, especially if it's been a stressful day. But no wonder it's calming. Um, so yeah, that is my third point of positivity. Please let me know down in that comment section what is making you guys smile today. Thank you for being here and sharing in the makeup happiness with me today. Um, I want to send you guys tons of love, wish you an amazing day, whatever it is that you are up to, and just I can't ever leave you without reminding you that life is just too short to wear boring lipstick.
Bye, guys.